Imagine a world where fast, reliable internet is as common as electricity, reaching every corner of the planet whether it's a remote village in the Amazon rainforest, a fishing boat in the middle of the Pacific, or a nomadic community in the vast Mongolian plains. For decades, this dream has seemed impossible, constrained by the challenges of traditional internet infrastructure. But now, a groundbreaking project is rewriting the rules of connectivity, bringing us closer than ever to a world where internet for all is a reality. Enter Starlink, Elon Musk's ambitious satellite network that's rapidly transforming global internet access. Today we're diving deep into how Starlink is reshaping the way we connect across the globe, its impact on underserved communities, its potential for the future, and the controversies surrounding it. Since its inception, Starlink has generated a lot of buzz. Developed by SpaceX, Starlink is a constellation of small satellites in low Earth orbit designed to provide high-speed internet around the world, especially in regions that are hard to reach with traditional broadband. But beyond the technical marvel, what does this mean for people and communities? Today, we'll explore the impact of Starlink, how it's changing lives and reshaping economies, the unique opportunities it presents, and the potential pitfalls that come along with it, the promise of global internet access. Let's start with the big picture why global internet access matters. In our digital age, access to the internet is more than just a convenience, it's a necessity. For some, the internet is a source of news, a way to stay connected with loved ones, and a tool for everyday tasks. But for millions around the world, especially in developing countries, it's also a lifeline to education, job opportunities, healthcare information, and critical services. Currently, about 3 billion people lack reliable internet access. Most of them live in rural or remote areas where laying fiber cables or installing cell towers is impractical or too costly. This lack of access perpetuates poverty, limits opportunities, and isolates entire communities. Starlink's goal is to eliminate these barriers, making high-speed internet available to anyone with a clear view of the sky. By beaming the internet down from thousands of satellites orbiting the Earth, Starlink bypasses the need for traditional infrastructure, opening doors that were previously shut to millions of people. Imagine a young student in rural Africa who can now attend online classes or a remote farmer in India who can access weather forecasts and market prices in real time. How Starlink Works So how does Starlink make this possible? Traditionally, satellite internet relies on large satellites placed in high geostationary orbit. But these satellites, though powerful, are far from Earth, leading to higher latency or lag in slower speeds. Starlink takes a different approach by using a network of thousands of smaller satellites in low Earth orbit, only around 340 miles above the planet. This reduces the distance data has to travel, resulting in lower latency and faster speeds. These satellites communicate with ground-based transceivers called user terminals, which connect to a Wi-Fi router in homes, schools, or businesses. What makes Starlink unique is its ability to provide speeds that rival those of traditional broadband with download speeds ranging from 50 Mbps to over 150 Mbps. For people who've never had access to anything close to these speeds, it's a game changer. However, to fully realize its vision, Starlink must deploy a vast network of satellites in Endeavor that's already underway. As of today, Starlink has launched over 3,000 satellites with plans to deploy around 12,000 more in the coming years, eventually aiming to have a total of 42,000 satellites orbiting the Earth. Impact on rural and remote communities. For rural and underserved communities, Starlink is more than just another internet provider, it's a potential lifeline. In places like rural America, where broadband options are limited or non-existent, Starlink offers a viable alternative that can support everything from virtual schooling to telemedicine. Imagine a rural clinic that can now conduct remote consultations with specialists in major cities, or a farmer who can now access real-time market information and adjust prices accordingly. In Canada's Northern Territories, for example, where extreme weather and rugged terrain make traditional infrastructure nearly impossible, Starlink has already begun providing internet access. Residents report that they can now stream videos, connect with friends and family on social media, and access online resources for the first time, transforming daily life and opening up new opportunities. The impact isn't limited to the developed world. In, in developing countries, where the digital divide is even more pronounced, Starlink could potentially accelerate economic growth by giving entrepreneurs, students, and healthcare providers the tools they need to compete and thrive in a globalized world. 
boosting economies and enabling innovation. The economic impact of global internet access cannot be overstated. According to studies, expanding internet access in developing nations could contribute billions to their economies by increasing productivity, improving education, and creating job opportunities. Starlink's potential to bring reliable internet to remote and underserved areas could ignite a new wave of innovation and economic growth. For small businesses in these regions, access to the internet means access to a global marketplace. Local artisans could sell their products on platforms like Etsy or eBay. Remote workers could join the global gig economy, working as freelancers in fields like graphic design, customer support, and programming. And young students who previously had limited access to resources can now learn from the world's top universities and educators, broadening their horizons and fueling new aspirations. On a larger scale, countries with large rural populations, like India or Brazil, could see significant economic shifts as more of their citizens gain access to online education, job training, and e-commerce platforms. The Dark Side of Starlink Of course, Starlink's rise isn't without controversy. One major concern is the environmental impact. The sheer number of satellites planned up to 42,000 raises questions about space debris and potential collisions. The Kessler Syndrome, a scenario in which a chain reaction of satellite collisions makes space travel hazardous, is a real concern as more companies launch satellites. There's also the issue of light pollution. Astronomers have voiced concerns about Starlink satellites interfering with telescope observations, potentially hindering our ability to study the universe. SpaceX has taken steps to mitigate this by adding sunshades to their satellites, but the problem remains. Privacy and data security also loom large. While Starlink promises to bridge the digital divide, some worry about who controls the infrastructure and what data might be collected in the process. For many, the idea of a private company owning a global network of satellites raises valid concerns about surveillance and corporate control over a critical service, the future of Starlink and global connectivity. So where is Starlink headed next? The technology is still in its early stages, but the progress so far is promising. SpaceX has announced plans to launch more advanced satellites, capable of higher speeds and greater coverage, and it continues to test new features like in-flight Wi-Fi for airplanes and internet access for moving vehicles like trucks and RVs. If successful, Starlink could become the backbone of a new era of internet access, one where people can stay connected regardless of where they live. This could pave the way for other advancements like IoT Internet of Things devices that can monitor environmental changes in real time, drone-based delivery systems in remote areas, and even better disaster response systems that can deploy reliable communication instantly. While it's still too early to predict the full scope of Starlink's impact, the potential is vast. What's clear is that SpaceX's ambitious project is pushing the boundaries of what's possible in the realm of global connectivity, inspiring other companies and organizations to innovate alongside them. Starlink is not just changing the internet, it's changing lives. By opening up new possibilities for connection, education, and economic growth, it holds the promise of a more connected, equitable world. But as we've discussed, with great power comes great responsibility. Balancing the benefits of global internet access with the potential downsides will be crucial. So as Starlink continues to expand and other companies join the race to connect the world, we're left with a critical question, will this new age of satellite internet help us build a more inclusive, empowered global society? Or will it simply be another tool of control for the few who have the resources to deploy it?